Scottish people love it when upon first meeting you dazzle them with your best attempt at a Scottish accent. Hey gang, today it's Scottish people Twitter. Yeah, these are supposed to be Scottish accents. No, I will not be mad at you if you click off. But for the rest of you, I shall commence the embarrassment. Scottish people on Twitter be like, do I want to go viral because people understand my tweets or think I'm funny? Or do I want to go viral because on all Scottish people think my accent's pure funny regardless of my path or sh**? It's a constant struggle. Can you imagine being a Scottish Hogwarts student and having to go down to London only to sit on a train for hours and then be like, I can see my house from the fucking train, you entitled English c**ts. Ah, sh**. I've accidentally called the Anglos c**ts. Here comes the hate speech spanking. Imagine having access to Barack Obama's Twitter account and no sending a DM to Donald Trump calling him a wee fanny. Melania, come over here and explain what a wee fanny is. What sort of communist speak is we fanny? Why does my Donald Trump sound like Bernie Sanders? COVID screens for kids in Glen Roads. When they go back to school, poor f**ks will think they're visiting their da. Ah, oh, shoot. I don't, I don't know what that means. I really hope that wasn't a racism. <sighs> After further research, I've determined Glen Rhodes is a city with a history of inconsistent employment opportunities, thereby concluding this post was making fun of poor people. Ergo, not a racism. Why do people get balloons for like everything now? Lucas for a shit in the big toilet. Yeah, and graduate nursery for fuck's sake. So proud of my boy, blah blah. I'd be bothering your way and mostly kept in the lines collar and the green giraffe and never a shit in his socks. F legend. Okay, I literally have no idea. Is he bothering her child? Asking about her child? This, this cannot be English. I love my pals, man. Is it just me or do birds describe everything as either way or cute? I'll be slagging your knob again, eh? Oh, shoot! I know what this one means! Okay, so bird translates to American as chick. We means little. Now, I know slag means sloot, uh, so slagging must be a sexualized action. Knob means a phallic organ, as demonstrated here by my original character, Amanda, the fly Amanda Nita. So, it appears this is a joke making fun of the other's member. Oh. Uh-huh. It's kind of mean of the wee bastard. F**k sake, who would throw away a four pack of hedgehogs and leave one in it? Aye. You can't be doing it. It's just a wee hedgehog. Wanna date someone from the UK so they can call me lad during sex. After sex? That's a f***ing pish lad, get the f**k. Oh, I, I know this one too. Uh, pish in American translates to or terrible. Get the f**k translates to American as kick rocks. I'm sorry, Mr. Nasex. She did not enjoy your company. I, however, am still free. Please respond, baby. A little heart emoji for spice. Was just at the bank and a wee old wife says to me, could you check my balance, son? So I pushed her. It's so nice to see the youngers taking care of their olders. Wonder if I've ever seen the same pigeon twice. Okay, well, first off, Birds aren't real, so let's get that straight right muff now. Secondly, most likely not. The hard drives on those birds are reset every night at the government docking station, so it's never the same bird for more than 24 hours. We have had reports of people playing in the flood water, including at north and south inches in Perth. This water should be contaminated and we should strongly advise people to avoid it. Dundonians on their holidays. Oh. God, what is a Dundonian? Watch it be a sexism. <sighs> huh, nope. Just means people from the city of Dundee 
What's with Scotland and hating other Scottish cities? Or Scots and other Scots! Damn Scots! They ruined Scotland! The fear is stalking somebody's photos whilst lying on your back and trapping the phone on your face. <laughs> Light with a rogue eyebrow. Ha! <laughs> you got caught. Everybody point and laugh. <laughs> on the night shift and walking down Argyle Street to Tesco and with hard hat on and a group of junkies shout, Look at the state of this and start doing the YMCA. You know... I knew deep down that all of the UK was actually a musical, so you guys can stop living your lie now. Mind when you were younger, you'd just run about the house naked, no getting a fucking have your mom wipe for ya. Ah, Canter man, what a do to be 14 again. Is this a. Is this a. Is this a fetish? This must be a fetish thing. No jokes, we do not kink shame here. Cats after they've had a scran. And I bet you dickhead. Aye, what scran you be giving your pussies? <laughs> I don't know why I went full pirate. What's, what snacks do you give your cat? Let me know in the comments. I want to know. <laughs> Santa, I don't know if you have me a football manager, but my family bought it and it would be no bad for tomorrow if I'm honest. No, son, I don't, but here, take a couple swedges to give you a dude done. Matty Crimbo. This literally cannot be English. I, I hope you guys are laughing real hard at whatever I'm trying to pass off as a Scottish accent because I just feel ridiculous now. Hey, what's up? I'm Aaron. Aaron Farr. I'm a runner. No need brag, mate. Aye, that's Aaron Farr of the Farr Clan. Well, if you can't tell whether I said the Far Clan or the Falklands, well, that's because you're both wrong, and I'm never gonna tell you what I meant to say, so, eh. Does anyone else's mommies, or daddies, or grannies not realize that a thumbs up on Messenger is f***ing cheeky as f***? You know, I rather like cheeky as a slang term. Kinda reminds me of the old sunscreen commercials. I can't exactly explain with words the imagery that the word cheeky brings to mind, so I have instead attempted to recreate it in Photoshop. You are welcome. 100% your granny's mentally stronger than ya. Gran up! Ain't that the truth. Grandmas are so tough. Like the video if you think your gran could beat up my gran. But you're wrong though. You're simply wrong. Well... I be done embarrassing myself for one video. Join the Discord where I discuss half-baked video ideas months ahead of time. Shout out to Teeth Fairy for the sprites and shout out to the patrons. Shout out to the rest of y'all. I really appreciate you guys watching my stuff, even when it's at my expense. I will see you next time. Bye for now.